तो इंडिया में इन्वेस्टिंग इन टू ई कॉमर्स देर आर इन मेनी अपॉर्चुनिटीज फ्लिपकार्ट इज ओन बाय वॉलमार्ट देर नॉट लिस्टेड हियर वन कैन आर्ग्यू यू कैन बाय वॉलमार्ट शेयर इन अमेरिका बट दैट वुड डाइवर्सिफाई यू टू मच दी ओनली ऑप्शन आई वुड से आर्ग्यूएबली इज नाइका जहाँ यू कैन गेट अ पीस ऑफ द ई कॉमर्स पाई इन इंडिया इन द लिस्टेड स्पेस वॉट यू गाइज थिंक ऑफ नाइका द बिजनेस मॉडल ऑफ नाइका एंड what do you think will happen to nike going forward i know there your competition but no we are not by the way like i i believe it's a very different business yeah. hmm. like we are a platform they are a brand so i think it's are they a brand cuz they're not they're distributing third party products yeah, but still they are a brand they are brand cuz uh, look at amazon as a brand it's a brand flipkart is a brand nike is a brand meesho is also a brand they have worked on building the brand so uh, yeah but my my still my thing was like they a lot of what they do offline online the kind of products they sell a lot of products are exclusive so basically but vast majority of what they sell ha huh. let's say they do 4000 crores of business a year let's say 5% margin kind of business uh, operating margin or net margin 5% but most of what they sell is third party products that they are distributing ha so that's why i think my understanding of the business could also be limited but from what i've seen how they've approached it a lot of that business has been built by getting supply that you won't get everywhere right so they've been much more focused on going very deep into that particular category and making it happen if if by the way you can get the same supply that you have in nike you have on you can get on amazon and they'll ship like the next day why won't you buy from there i really should not happen right but it does not if somebody is buying are they betting into the story of india to growing significantly and india one growing as well but uh, but the woman child is getting uh, getting into beauty even in india too in a very significant way so there is some budget of the family going into beauty beauty as a category is also growing significantly that's actually a very interesting question let's but india too by the way in terms of beauty ends up being lipstick nail polish Whatever or foundation but, but that's also three category three sku is not small ha huh, but it's it very three four five so it will how does one ev- evaluate something like nike How does one benchmark? I am asking because you both are in e-commerce. You have had Flipkart, Udan. You have Misho. If I am an investor trying to figure out, I should invest in the company. Like I think Falguni is an exceptional entrepreneur. I know her, and I think if anybody can pull it off, it's possibly or likely her. Uh, she's had an exceptional past and great management and all of those things. But the broader question is, how big? is the e-commerce pie in india and are we betting based on the valuations of whatever i mentioned are we betting that india 1 and 2 will grow to x percentage in the next 5 years or 10 years is that the bet we are making yeah i i don't know the answer to that question and i won't even attempt but what i know is i don't think that company is a good representation of india e-commerce because it's very narrow in a category and very narrow in terms of the customer base they serve their average order value if i remember comes from 1500 1800 2000 something like that it's not less yeah ha huh? no, but it's not it's quite it's high it's yeah. very high so my point is it's super high so the segment exposure and category exposure cannot be a representation of the e-commerce market that's what i believe okay let's talk about misho ha huh? let's make it more interesting what is your valuation today valuation today my our valuation this is the last round was about 5 billion Okay, and uh, give us some metrics, like some numbers, I and mean, whatever is publicly. Available. Yeah, something we have about fourteen crore people who buy from us every year, about a million small businesses. Um, in the last one year, we did about one billion orders, which is about hundred crore. That's so about hundred crore orders in the last twelve months. Um, Insane numbers, by the way. Insane numbers. Right, fourteen crore people buying, huh? Yeah, and and by the way, we sell across. So horizontal platform, people come and sell anything they want. Right. So about half is apparel, and half is non-apparel. and that includes kids beauty personal care your electronics so home and kitchen like the gross sales that happen on yeah so about like last 2020 calendar year was about 4 and a half quarter to 5 billion um so which is last year and what is the margin on the top level out of this 5 billion you sell on average how much margin do you have uske niche mat ja bas ho gaya like Why do you want to open my P&L in front of me here right now? Right, right. 
I think in yeah. ticket size ka challenge aata hai na. Uh-huh. Dealing with that kind of customers. Right, but ticket size come hoga na. Three twenty, and that's the I'm saying that's the problem we have to solve. Like so, that's, that's the biggest problem. Correct. What would that be for Flipkart? Would be much higher again, twelve hundred, thirteen hundred, yeah, maybe higher. Because bahar pe wo electronics, mobile phone takes the average order value quite high. Plus, plus Mintra on tarah hai, to unka bahut jada. Mintra. We didn't answer so integrated. Back. We didn't answer the Nike thing. What are the final thoughts on a company like Nike? Because I don't have another listed player in mind. <laughs> What's your interest? <laughs> no, I said like. I said I don't know about the company, but I I don't believe it represents India e-commerce. But, okay, but that's okay. I I believe it's uh, it's picked up the right category at the right time, and secondly, they build their own strength of the content to commerce. I think it was a very interesting way they built it. Uh, there are negatives that uh, they have attracted attention, and too many players are coming in. Uh, they need to. I build their own uh, brand and the ecosystem which they might be doing they went into too many things now or they went into b2b but i was surprised that even uh, they i never thought that beauty and fashion as a adjacency will work as much but uh, nike is not doing bad on fashion yeah they just launched that aloe yoga no so um, they are the distributor for it killing it that brand of god it's 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 doing reasonably quite okay So in in if they are able to build adjacency, it becomes an interesting story. I think one thing you have to give it to the uh, uh, by the Nike, they have built the business with the discipline, unit economy, so that they have gone to market and definitely <laughs> the market believes in the, uh, their IPO. Like everybody, they are still holding up very high given the comparison to their revenue. I think only problem is how to expand their their TAM. uh is it the similar because the, the category they are in it's already niche and build as a commerce so it's very hard to say that it's a full fledged e-commerce i will not call it as a platformized e-commerce it's a vertical definitely they are di- building other verticals also adjacency but it's a difficult journey let's see if i had to like figure out e let's say i'm i have 100 rupees to invest mm-hmm. and i want to invest in e-commerce किस पे बेट लगाना चाहिए ये अभी है नहीं आएगा आई फील लाइक बिकॉज इवन नाउ मोर एंड मोर वॉट्स को ना कम इन द पब्लिक मार्केट वॉट पीपल से इज लेकिन नायका है नाउ फर्स्ट क्राइंग विल गो पब्लिक विल बी वेरी सिमिलर लाइक वन सेक्टर सर्टन वो दैटेशन विद ओ एन डी सी विद मेनी प्लेटफॉर्म नो नो आई थिंक दैट्स वाई वॉट्स हैपनिंग इज दिस वैल्यू वैल्यू एडिंग ब्रांड्स आर गोइंग ऑनलाइन प्लेटफॉर्म विल कम एंड आई डोंट नो both the other plat- platform walmart and amazon they will list in india unlikely so hopefully we will do it at some point in time right but i feel like that the e-commerce exposure that you keep referring to mm-hmm. unless you take parts of all of them say ke yaar sab karke at least we'll have some exposure otherwise yeah, all of them are waste aap dekho ke jio hai they have a big aspiration so all the tata noon ne kuch kuch kar rahe hain abhi to wo bhi ho hi raha hai na hi i'm nikhil uh, thank you for watching the podcast Let us know who your favorite guest has been and who you'd like to watch next. Thank you.